So you're faced with either spending a lot of money on an emission system, exhaust system, keep it running or you pull it off. Um, we've been faced with that question a lot of different times and really sympathize with the fact that you know, you're thinking about spending upwards of $10,000 to put your truck back on the road and the only difference when you get your truck back is the fact that you now have an emission system that's working again. And you really don't know how long it's going to work for because the last time it only lasted six months and you were broken down again. You hear everybody tell you that if you delete the exhaust system or the after treatment system you're going to get better fuel mileage. Most operators spend more on fuel than they spend on anything else in the year. So the idea of fuel economy, better fuel economy is pretty enticing versus spending $10,000 to put exhaust system, exhaust treatment back on your engine. The last time you were down for three days and you had to spend it in a hotel, so you lost a load, you had to have somebody else come and pick up a load, you had a hotel bill, you were stuck at a shop that they knew you had no other choices, so you were paying the highest rate possible. They had the next day parts in and you left there again with another $10,000 bill and what was different? Nothing. I get the idea of trying to delete your emission system because it's what you think is the solution, it's the best. Sometimes you think it's the only solution. Uh, you've got shops that can't get the check engine light to go out. So, you know, what was the old scenario? You put a piece of tape over it, you pull the bulb out. So what do you do? You delete the emission system on it and then if you pull into uh, a dealership and they open the hood and they see you've deleted it, they shut the hood and tell you they won't work on it. So you don't have a lot of great choices. You go into some of the states that have monitoring and testing and you can't travel in those states any longer because you've modified your engine. If you go to trade that truck in, they won't accept that truck because the ignition system's been modified. So we're really seeing a situation where people are actually deciding instead of deleting these systems, we now have a couple options for you to keep them on and actually make these systems run correctly. Let's not delete. Let's not go find that repair shop that's kind of in the back corner that will only take cash and they won't give you uh, a bill for everything that you just had done to strip your emission systems off. Let's find a shop that knows how to fix the emission system. Let's find the shop that is knowledgeable about it and then we can supply you the parts that you need to that shop to fix it. Let's go ahead and fix it the right way and let's keep your price down, let's keep the tailpipe clean, let's keep your operational costs down, let's bring your profit back up.